Reflect across the y-axis. Ugh, my y-axis is right here. So what's going to happen with this picture is I'm going to reflect inside of a mirror. So basically what's going to happen is whatever shows up over here is gonna be opposite over here, and whatever shows up on the left is gonna be opposite over here. So there's gonna be a little bit of sloppiness, but that's okay. The y-axis is my mirror, so I'm going to draw a line on the y-axis acting as my mirror. I'm gonna draw it all the way down even though it's not necessary. All right, there you go. The best way to do a reflection is you take each point one at a time and find out how far away it is from the mirror. So let's start with A because it's kind of like the clearest one that I can use. A appears to be one, two, three, four units away from the mirror. So let's graph it one, two, three, four units away in the opposite direction and call it A prime. Let's do it again with the other letters. We're gonna run into each other, that's okay. W is one unit away from the mirror. So W prime is also going to be one unit away from the mirror. D is one unit away from the mirror. So D prime is also gonna be one unit away from the mirror. And M is one unit away from the mirror. So M prime is also going to be one unit away from the mirror. So we take that, we connect the dots the best that we can. And as you can see, we have the exact same image just kind of flipped, not flipped, uh, reflected. I like to view these as when my art teacher wanted to be lazy in grade school, they would give us all pieces of paper and say, put a bunch of paint on the paper, fold it in half and open it back up and you have a butterfly. That's kind of like what we have here, a butterfly or angel's wings, whatever your religion is. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to list what these points are uh, just because you might have a teacher that asks you to. So D prime, I'm going to go to my origin and the way I get to D prime is I go left one up one, two, three, four, five. So D prime was left one, negative one, up five, positive five. A prime has me starting from the origin and going left one, two, three, four, and up one, two, three. So left four, up three, that's a prime. Ooh, I'm gonna avoid a curse word and put W next. I know it's spelled differently, but you know, you never know who's watching these things. Uh, start at the origin, go right one, up one, two, three, four. So right one, up four is W prime and M. Oh, I wish it was a G, it could be dog. I go right one, up one, two, three, four, five. Uh, right one, up five. And that's reflecting. Dog, <laughs> dom. <laughs> uh.